Hey guys, Off Grid Technology here. Just wanted to show you a little project that I'm working on for my Tacoma. Um, I wanted to be able to get some extra battery power, um, including AC, DC, things like that, uh, that I could take with me on my Tacoma. Uh, so what I ended up doing is picking up one of these boxes here. Uh, it's an MTM case guard box, um, just a little ammo cam box. Put in some DC uh, outlets here on the top. Flip it over and I'll show you the inside here. And right now I'm just using um, two of these Miati, they're 16 amp uh, lithium iron phosphate batteries. And it's plugged into a Wanderer, just a cheap little PWM controller. Um, right now these batteries are sitting about 13.4 volts. They are hooked up in parallel. Um, so you can see that the positives are connected together, negatives are connected together. Um, this will get cleaned up here probably in the next uh, week or so. I'm waiting on a couple other parts to come in. Um, there's going to be an SAE connector in here, which will plug into the solar charge controller um, and sit on the side of the box. I'm not sure what side I'm going to have it sitting on yet, uh, but that way we can charge by solar. I um, also have an SAE power plug in connector for it, um, which will allow me to plug it in through AC and charge it, uh, DC charge it through my truck, um, things like that. So just a little thing I'm working on. Um, let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Um, if you think this is a good idea, you find these useful, especially for going overlanding on a Tacoma um, or pretty much anything else that you want to go on. Um, you can see the sockets has a 12 volt, well, just a standard 12 volt, uh, you know, lighter socket. Um, I do have quick charge USB 3.0 um, on here. It does have the meter. The meter does not flicker. It only flickers for the video. Um, and then we have a master switch here, which will turn this whole section on and off. Um, there will be another switch that will be going in, which will turn the solar, the charging on and off, um, as well as the uh, inverter. Uh, I just haven't found an inverter that I can sit in this box here. Um, eventually, it's going to sit here in the top. Um, this will all be cinched down. Everything will be covered here in the top. Um, and then we're gonna actually going to move the charge control to the top. And then the alternator will sit up, or excuse me, the... Um, the inverter will sit up here somewhere. Uh, just try to get it out of the way. I'll end up having uh, a plug or two coming out the top. Uh, might do some other things like put USB or sorry, DC lights on here, things like that. Uh, just to start, let me know what you guys think. Uh, put the comments down below and thank you for following.